so it's, it's okay to condemn a racist sheriff in Alabama, but not us, please. Don't touch our privilege and power. And uh, that's a large part of the background. Uh, these issues are very real. There's more issues here. Racism is a very serious problem in the United States. There's, you know, take a look at the scholarly work on it, say George Fredrickson's uh, study of uh, white supremacy, comparative study. Uh, he, he concludes, I think, plausibly that the white supremacy in the United States was even more extreme and savage than in South Africa. Uh, just think of our own history. You know, our economy, our wealth, our privilege relies very heavily on a century of horrifying slave labor camps. Uh, the cotton, cotton production was not just the fuel of the Industrial Revolution. It was the basis for the, uh, uh, the financial system, the uh, merchant system, commerce, uh, England as well. These were bitter, brutal slave labor camps. There's a recent study by Edward Baptiste which comes out with some startling information. It's called—actually, the title is startling, something like, uh, The Half Was Never Told which is more or less true, was never told. But, for example, he shows pretty convincingly that in the slave labor camps, the plantations, we call them politely, uh, the uh, productivity increased more rapidly than in industry with no technological advantage, advance, just the bullwhip, just by driving people harder and harder to the point of survival, they were able to increase productivity and profit. And it's not just the—he also points out that the word torture is not used in discussion of this period. He introduces it should be used. I mean, these are camps that could have impressed the Nazis. And it is a large part of the basis for our wealth and privilege. Uh, is there a slave museum in the United States? Actually, the first one is just being established now by private some private donor. I mean, this is the core of our history, along with the uh, extermination or expulsion of the native population. But it's, it's not part of our consciousness.